In the quiet town of Shinrin, nestled deep within the misty mountains of Japan, there lived a venerable Zen master named Ryu. His wisdom was renowned far and wide, and people traveled from distant lands to seek his guidance on matters of life and enlightenment. One day, a group of eager seekers gathered at Ryu's humble temple, hoping to learn the ten things they should never do in life. But the wise master had a different lesson in mind. Ryu greeted his visitors with a warm smile and invited them to sit in the tranquil garden behind his temple. Surrounded by the beauty of nature, he began to share his teachings. Life is a precious gift, Ryu began, and it is often easier to understand its true essence by focusing on the things you should do rather than dwelling on what you should not. He then unveiled ten stones each engraved with a word symbolizing an action to embrace in life. These were the ten things to do that would lead to a fulfilled and meaningful existence. 1. Love Ryu picked up the first stone, engraved with the symbol for love. Love unconditionally, he said, for in love you find the essence of human connection. 2. Learn He held the second stone, bearing the symbol for learning. Never stop learning, Ryu advised, for wisdom grows with knowledge, and a curious mind is a vibrant mind. 3. Forgive. The third stone displayed the symbol for forgiveness. Let go of grudges and resentments, Ryu implored. Forgiveness liberates your soul and heals your heart. 4. Serve. Ryu lifted the fourth stone, marked with the symbol for service. Serve others selflessly, he emphasized. In helping those in need, you find purpose and fulfillment. 5. Create. The fifth stone bore the symbol for creation. Express your creativity, Ryu encouraged. For through art, music, and innovation, you contribute to the world's beauty. 6. Listen. He held up the sixth stone, representing listening. Listen attentively, Ryu said. Hear the stories of others and, in their words, discover the shared humanity that binds us. 7. Reflect. Ryu picked up the seventh stone, etched with the symbol for reflection. Take time for inner contemplation, he advised. In silence, you find your true self. 8. Connect. The eighth stone displayed the symbol for connection. Build meaningful relationships, Ryu stressed for the connections you form with others enrich your life. 9. Laugh. Ryu held the ninth stone, bearing the symbol for laughter. Embrace joy and laughter, he smiled. They are the music of the soul. 10. Give. Finally, he raised the tenth stone, engraved with the symbol for giving. Give generously, Ryu concluded. In giving, you receive the boundless riches of the heart. As the seekers listened to Ryu's teachings, they realized that life's true essence lay not in a list of prohibitions, but in the positive actions they could undertake. The Ten Stones became a source of inspiration and a reminder of the path to a life well-lived. In the tranquil town of Shinrin, under the guidance of Zen master Ryu, the seekers learned that the secret to a meaningful life was not in avoiding pitfalls, but in embracing the virtues that enriched their journey. With hearts full of gratitude, they left the temple, ready to embark on a life filled with love, learning, forgiveness, service, creativity, listening, reflection, connection, laughter, and giving. And in doing so, they discovered the true wisdom of their venerable master.